All right, let's uh, let's get to the comment section as we've asked the question, what percent chance does OBJ become a Titan in 2022? So Odell Beckham Jr., let, let's let's play a quick guessing game here, Sam, before we get to the comments. Oh, what, boy. what is Odell Beckham Jr.'s career earnings in the NFL oh, so far? That's not where I thought you were going. Let's see. Just a quick he's, guess. He's in year what eight? I'll say he's at. Well, I'll put him at ninety-five million. Ooh, you were close. You're over eighty-two million okay. career earnings. So he's made a lot of money. He wants to make more, and I'm not talking about DJ more. Uh, he wants to make more money this year as kind of a grab bag for 2022 coming off that ACL. So what percentage chance do the Titans actually land Odell Beckham Jr. after Fowler came in with a, a good report saying that he would be a fit with Tennessee? I got to scroll all the way back up because we've got a ton of comments. Steven says 10%. Major says 13%. Mark D says 0%. Uh, Trevon says 5%. We got another 5% coming in from Jay. James Harrison Said, or Henderson, excuse me, says 20%. Wilbur says 5 Grim Jim says 10 Locker Room Nightmare. There's another Locker Room Nightmare comment from Eric. I've been, see, I've been seeing a lot of that, and I'll just say he wasn't one when they won the Super Bowl last year. So, I mean, you can – I heard him called a cancer earlier. Well, he wasn't a cancer with his ring last year in the – the way he performed down the stretch in those playoffs for the Rams. Yeah, uh, John says 10%. Easy Clap G says 5%. Uh, Louis says 15%. Titan Fox says 15%. MB with 5 Chris Frazier, 0 Sin City says 1%. Caleb brings up, can OBJ block? That's a can you block downfield with that ACL? That's That actually is a good comment. That's important to them, so. Uh, Chris Stress says 25%. Uh, Lou Man says double oh seven percent. So uh, play, a little play on words there from Lou Man. Ten percent. We got thirty from Kenny. Uh, Michael says seven percent. So very. I mean, these are low. We don't have a lot. There's twelve point five there from Nick. Uh, Brad says fifteen percent. A lot of comments, which is good. Sam, what percentage do you give the Titans to sign? Odell Beckham Jr. and essentially win those sweepstakes this season. Yeah, I uh, I think chat's pretty accurate. I, I would give them. I have ten percent written down. Uh, I think it's in that area. I do think it's not zero percent. They're not the odds-on favorite either. I think they're going to be in the mix, and there's a couple factors. One, OBJ wants to go to a winner. So as much as fans of certain teams, namely like Chicago or even the New York Giants, might want him, right? I don't think OBJ is going back to New York, and OBJ doesn't want to play for a team that's only going to win six games in the Bears. So he wants to go to a winner. He wants to play in the playoffs. That's step one. And as we mentioned in the AFC South, the Titans give him an opportunity to do that because you know they will be in this division until the very end and right now sit in the driver's seat of their division. Uh I'm not sure I see them being the highest bidder, but they OBJ also has to consider the situation, right? And he comes to Tennessee, at least right now, you could make an argument he's their number one option. Like Robert Woods is there, a guy that he has played with before. Uh, did I Well, at least been in the same locker room with before in uh, Los Angeles last year. But him and Robert Woods together, I don't know who your number one is. So I give them 10%. I think they're in the mix. They're probably still an underdog because it is Tennessee. And let's face it, OBJ is Mr. Flashing Lights, as we mentioned earlier. And he is going to go from New York, quick pit stop in Cleveland, and chose immediately to go to shiny Los Angeles. And I think uh, that's more characteristic for him. I could see him doing that a little bit. I think the Chargers are a good play. Back to the Rams is a good play with the relationship he has with Sean McVay. But the Titans should be in the mix. I think they have a shot because if you're looking football from a football-only perspective, he has a really good chance to play here and get targeted here, which I think is important to him. Yes, but I think here is my struggle. They're a running football team. And they run the football. They don't pass the football. And you're going 
with Ryan Tannehill. My percentage is simple. What what number is Odo Beckham Jr.? Three? You're going to three? Three. Three percent chance. 